During my time as ambassador, I uncovered evidence that one of the great houses has been corrupted by a foreign influence and is plotting against the Empire. I was thrown into Urapenthe as punishment for digging too close to the truth. The fugitive Drake suggested that we travel to the Vor system. We hope to find evidence that will prove there is an internal threat to the Empire. Greetings fellow gamers, this is Gassard the Casual Gamer and we are back in Star Trek Online doing the mission Friend or Foe. Uh, this is actually a second playthrough of the mission because my first uh, <coughs> excuse me, my first recording glitched out so hopefully this will make it to YouTube. Let's see, we've entered the Vora system, the starbase is dead ahead. And it's operated by scientists. Iridian scientists, that's unusual. The Iridians are not known for their scientific prowess, but the research station is listed as a protected asset. According to your ship's computer, the Iridians have a trade agreement with a human scientist named Amar Singh. He is working with someone in the Empire on a genetic research project. It's unclear what Drake expected us to find here. Well, let's find out. Boy, this is a slow ship. This is Research Facility Logner Beta 3. I am Plardos Yarden, commander of the station. With whom am I speaking? You're speaking to me, Kapanik. Uh, we weren't informed there would be visitors today. How may we serve the Empire? We're here to inspect the station. Commander Plardos, you will provide this ship's computer access to all recent station communication logs. You will also transmit a manifest of shipments and supply delivery receipts for the last month. Okay, and we expect full cooperation. Uh, um, well, this is unexpected. You do realize that we have an agreement with your government and Dr. Singh. Our research is highly classified. You do have some sort of official order granting permission to view these records? Of course. We'll send it right over. Send us the information. You're completely mad. This is a top security installation. You don't have authorization to access our records. We're filing a formal complaint. You're hiding something. Of course we're hiding something. We're conducting classified research. That's why you are not authorized to access station records. You do understand the concept of top secret, don't you? You dare insult my authority? This is preposterous! We refuse to hand over top secret information without proper authorization. We will defend ourselves, if necessary. You stink of guilt.
one's fairly easy. Let him respond. I'm answering, like, of course. We received a distress call from this station. We are here to provide assistance. Your assistance is no longer needed. Station Commander Plados sounded distressed. He mentioned a disagreement with a Klingon vessel. It would be dishonorable of us not to investigate. This isn't your business. We appreciate the delicate nature of the situation. Would you mind if we spoke with the station? Perhaps we could resolve any misunderstanding. Be my guest. I find this very suspicious. Why would Romulans respond to a distress call here? You think? They hail the station on an open frequency and then immediately switch to an encrypted channel. Alert me if you notice anything. I don't need to remind you that we're in Klingon territory. Nope. The fact that these Romulans are here at all could be the clue we need. Drake said we'd find evidence, but not clues. Station transported several crates. There's our evidence. Hail the Romulans. Commander Plados has explained the situation. It sounds as if there's been a miscommunication. You're a Romulan. You lie every time you draw breath. The foolish bravado of the Klingon Empire. Attacking your own station and then accusing us of wrongdoing. I should have expected something like this. Very well. We'll communicate in terms you can understand. You're gonna regret this. Shields. Down you go. One more, huh? That hurt. is thankful for your assistance. We had tracked the Tal Shiar ah, to the system, but we would have been outmatched okay. without your aid. You fought well for Romulan. The Romulan Republic faces many challenges, but conflict with the Klingon Empire should not be one of them. As a gesture of good faith, I'll share with you information that you might find I'm to listening. be of value. We believe Tall Shi'ar agents are collaborating with operatives in the Klingon Empire to steal weaponry and technology. We have uncovered large supplies of Klingon weapons on the planet Nimbus III that we believe are being stockpiled there by agents of the Empress. 
The stolen goods are being transferred through several facilities in the local sector, including this and you have proof station. of this. The shipping manifests on the supply crates and the weapons themselves. By tracking the flow of goods, we've learned that there are agents in the Klingon Empire transferring stolen supplies to the Tal Shiar. Those supplies are being stockpiled on Nimbus 3. If you will help track down the source of those weapons, we will share our data with you. You can send us the data, but I'm not making any promises. Transferring the data now. We expect the Klingon Empire to track down the source of these stolen goods and punish those responsible before more weapons fall into the wrong hands. If we discover any further information, we will notify the Empire's ambassador on Mul Rihan. Give me that Plardos. Please listen to me. We were only following protocol. We must ensure that our research doesn't fall into the then wrong Then why are you hands. trading in stolen goods? We we didn't know the shipments we were transferring were stolen. I, I was told that the crates were medical supplies needed on the war front. We didn't ask questions. Please show mercy. We were only doing what we were ordered to do. Give me what do. I want. Due to present circumstances, we will forego normal security authorization and provide the files you have requested. We live to serve Give me it before I lose my patience. Received data from the Kimtar request. It took some time to analyze. In the meantime, we are prepared to leave the system on your command. Let's do it. Your officers have analyzed the shipping logs from the research facility. Their findings confirm what the Romulan Republic officer told us. Someone has been routing technology and weapons to the Tal Shiar. And they are going to great lengths to cover their tracks. And one of the great houses is involved? An operation of this magnitude would require the resources of one of the houses. But the shipments are being routed in such a way to conceal their point of origin. Our evidence is circumstantial. <sighs> it was my eagerness to point fingers without proof that landed me in Urapenthe in the first place. We must exercise patience and wait for our prey to reveal Drake themselves. mentioned your father. My father is Ambassador Worf. He has many friends and many enemies. I tried to convince him that one of the houses was moving in the shadows against us. He either didn't believe me, or didn't care. Either way, he made his decision when he refused to act after I was sent to Urapinthe. His pride is a weakness our enemy will Perhaps try to I exploit. Can him. You can try, but we must be prepared if he doesn't. We should at least warn him of the danger, even if he refuses to see the knife in Don't his worry. throat. Don't worry. We'll be there if they strike. Okay, now I'm going to First City.
Let's find Ambassador Worf. And not the wall. Alright, here we go. Greetings. How may I assist you? Fight with honor. I will. Perhaps. First, tell me who you are. I'm Lieutenant Commander Kapanik. Greetings. How may I assist you? That is an odd request. We stand in the courtyard of the Great Hall, and honor has no need of secrecy. If you cannot speak your mind in this place, then I have no desire to hear what Very you well. have to say. Very well. I'm here with your son. That is not my son's name. If Kemtar wishes to talk, tell him to come and speak to me. I will not communicate through intermediaries. He said you were both in great danger. He is the only one in danger, unless you have been foolish enough to listen to his tales. But you have already made that mistake. If you have spoken to him, then you have been to Ruripenthe. A great house is plotting your death. You better watch out. I am Ginta to the house of Martok. Lady Sorella has declared vengeance on the house of Jimpok. It would not surprise me if all the great houses wish me dead. Tell my son that I am capable of defending myself. How about if I told you the Romulans were involved? Romulans? That does not make sense. Jim Puck's position towards the Federation and the Tal Shiar is very clear. And in this, he has my house's full support it would be foolish for any house to make such a connection. However, I would not be surprised to hear you mention the house We don't of even know Duras. if Duras is involved. And that is exactly the sort of accusation that landed my son in a penal colony. Tell Kemtar that unless he has proof, he should stay silent. If he is a fugitive from Rura Pente, he will only make his situation worse. I do not want to know any more about what you I'll two tell are him. plotting. Okay, get over here, get a little more privacy. Has war for Greece to speak that your to name us? Is not Kimtar. name I use is not important. Did you, you tell him what we've concerned. learned? Did you tell him the Romulans are involved? Given their history, I've considered the possibility that the House of Duras might be involved. Is he at least willing to review our evidence? he wants nothing to do with our investigation. yai -cha! He's a stubborn old man, and he is going to get himself killed. at least killed. the house of Martok. Agreed. If the Jin talk to House Martok will not listen, we will take our concerns to the house itself. Martok's son Drex is off-world. I will contact Lady Sorella. Don't be discouraged. You must meet with Lady Sorella from the house of Martok. She must Will be do. warned. Alright, fellow casual gamers, this is Gassar the Casual Gamer, and it looks like this is about uh, the end of the video. We're at the rewards section, we just finished. Got a little bit of expertise into Lithium War, and, and uh, like I said at the beginning of the video, this is the second walkthrough since um, the first one glitched out when I tried to render the video. So I. I'm going to take a field generator. Congratulations, Lieutenant Commander. Looks 
like we got a bunch of stuff too. We'll go over that maybe at the beginning of the next video. Again, this is Gasari the Casual Gamer. I want to thank you for watching. Uh, the next video will start um, a new section of the Klingon Faction missions. I'm going to go ahead and do that since this has been such uh, fun. I'm going to continue definitely with the videos. Uh, if you like the video, of course, press like below. And subscriptions are always appreciated. And why not check out some of these videos that are posted on my channel. Thank you, and I'll see you soon.